Ah, oh, summertime. Nothing better than heading up to the lake with a bunch of friends, spending your days in the water and your nights around the campfire, drinking, laughing, and having a good time. I tell you, man, there's nothing better than getting out of the city and doing a little roughing it. Oh, 
floating down the river. Now this is a really fun song, and actually, a couple summers ago, I headed up to uh, Penticton, and uh, we floated down that canal, and that's sort of what inspired the whole song. And, uh, and then later on, we actually made a video for it. It's really fun. And we filmed a video down at Davidson's pool, and we had drones and everything. It was really, really cool. You can check that out. There's probably going to be a link down below there, so you can check out the, the actual music video. Heading out of town, a bunch of us, cooler full of beer, and the float is pumped up. Into mattress, giant duck, it's going to be a good day. I got no worries, saint in a hurry. Just floating down the river Oh yeah Found a team hotel Stash of stuff A couple more drinks and we're heading out Party on the river get a little messed up Till the summer's on I got no worries Ain't in a hurry Just floating down the river Yeah In the summer sun
So I don't know about you guys, but uh, I've always had a fantasy of you know being at a festival, and at the end, you know, and they're all jumping up in the air, they go, rah, rah, rah. So this next song, Living for the Summer, this is like uh, I imagined the end of the night song. It's been an encore. We just rocked the house. Everybody had a really good time, and we're pumping out Living for the Summer. So maybe in your imagination, you can kind of feel this when you're listening to the song. What's not to like about girls in bikinis showing off their tans and roughing around in the water with the beer in your hand? Spending days down the lane, kicking off things the sand. There ain't nothing better than this, so come on, just raise your hands. Beach Bay, Billabong, pretty girl. Let's go. 
goes out to all you folks out there that have a beautiful backyard all decked out and ready for summer. You got your barbecues, you got your cold beer fridge, maybe even got a pool. This is for you. Well, you know where you want to go. Sun's hot, time moves slow. Gonna make this long chair my throne in my backyard bed when die. Set up the speakers on the patio, maybe play it loud or keep it real mellow. Come on over, let's have some fun in my backyard bed when die. The lawn's cut and the booth is right. The barbecue's keeping no for tonight. Maybe getting myself. A little afternoon light in my backyard there will die. Might wanna read a book or maybe skin and dip or something called around for me to sit. I bet you if you had a place like this, your own backyard there will die. Well, it's a little bit of heaven to your back, and you can make all the Well, some people got to get away, take planes or trains, or even drive for days. No one was summoned and to be delayed in my backyard bed and die. Don't need to pack everything's in reach. Don't need a head for a lake or even a beach. You got a maid in the shade, and that's right by me in my backyard. Just kicking back here in the shade A watching time float away Here in my backyard Have some fun, Victor
Sinatra, living for the summer. For over 10 years, I've been working abroad in countries like uh, Thailand, the Middle East, Bahrain, uh, Singapore. And for over two years now, I've been working my way back into the scene here in Canada, especially in British Columbia. And what I did, I put out this album, Living for the Summer, and it's 12 songs about summertime. And uh, at first, I used all studio musicians, and I didn't know anybody in the community. But now I've been back for about two and a half years, and I've found the musicians that I really like to work with. The first musician I'd like to talk about is Victor Cronley, and I just love this guy. He's got a beautiful tone, and he's a great sound man. He's always saved my butt for sound. And he, did, he just, he's just got a feeling that just really adds a lot to the music. Next, I met Milo Jennings, and I actually met Milo through Victor. And uh, I saw him one time at a jam and was like, man, I gotta play with this guy. And I worked at it, and we finally got some chances to play together, and well, it's been magic ever since. The next person I'd like to introduce to you is Shane Wollenshine, the bass player. Man, he filled in one time when we needed a bass player, and he, he just made the music feel so good. And I knew at that point I got to do a recording with this guy. Uh, the next musician that I got is Doug McFetridge, and uh, I actually met him while playing with this band, Blue Scarlet, a pop band here in British Columbia, and we shared some really nice uh, magic moments, working as a duo, and I came over to his house and we jammed for hours, and uh, I just knew right then this is a person that I like to do music with. I'm Peter James, and thank you for taking time to watch my video. If you like the album, you can uh, actually email me direct, or you can go to my website, which the link is below, or uh, it's on iTunes, Spotify, all different ones like that. But uh, yeah, I hope you uh, get the album a listen. If you don't, on YouTube I have a playlist. You can listen to the whole thing, make sure you like the songs.